Hey y'all, it's Randy Hauser, and you're about to watch me answer the Ask Anything questions you sent into Bobby Bones. Thanks to Bobby Bones and everybody with the show for their support. Let's see, we'll start out. Nava from Grantsville, or Nava, I'm not sure. She says, saw you live in 2013 at Country Explosion in Tuella, Utah, and the summer with Billy Currington, Kelly Pickler, and Leanne Rhymes came. Have you ever messed up a song when singing? When, uh... A, when you get nervous singing it live of course yep several times mostly i'd forget the words to them but it's probably because something's going on in my ear monitors or something like that where I, something would throw me off but yeah you, you we do get nervous from time to time and mess things up laura from tallahassee says what is the best experience that you have had at a live show i think every one of them are very special um anytime i'm getting to play music live is freaking amazing um but probably my favorite experience was, uh, I think it was Hunter Mountain or somewhere in New York. I'm not sure, but my band bus broke down and I ended up having to play for like 25,000 people with, for an hour with just my guitar. And it ended up being one of the most fun experience I ever experiences I've ever had. So that was cool. Alyssa from Garner, which song off this album means the most to you? I'd say probably, um, probably True. I wrote it for uh, Tatiana. Uh, who's my fiance and it was uh it just means a lot to me jeremiah from bellevue what's your favorite song to perform hmm. that's that's a tough one it could be like a cowboy could be one of them and also uh you know there's another one that i've been performing lately called no good place to cry that i wrote years ago and i've never recorded uh god i look like hell this morning <laughs> Uh, Matea from Mendes says, do you dip your fries in ketchup or drizzle the ketchup? I'm a dipper. I'm a dipper. I dip. I wish I could have some French fries right now. I'm dying for a French fry. <laughs> Jeremy from Singapore. That's a long way. I bet that's Jeremy Chua. Which song off Fired Up describes you most in a nutshell? I'd say Fired Up right now for sure. Amelia from Miami says, what kind of music do you like? Well, I like country music. I love country music. <laughs> Thank you, Amelia. Chris from Athens, what's your go-to pair of boots? It depends on the occasion, but right now, I'm really into the uh, R.M. Williams boots. They're from Australia. They're very, very comfortable, and they're easy to get on and off. And uh, So R.M. Williams, it depends on that, but my hunting boots are, are just depends on what I'm doing. Um, Carol from Lexington, is there another country singer that you text with all the time? Oh my God, I text with a bunch of them, and a bunch of them don't text me back. That's pretty much what's happened. No, <laughs> no, I text with a lot of my buddies. A lot of my best buddies are um, are other country singers. We've kind of come up together in in Nashville writing songs together, so we everybody stays in touch. Um, but uh, you know, just Lee Bryce, Jamie Johnson, uh, Jared Neiman. Uh, Luke, uh, Tyler Hubbard, a bunch of different people we text uh, with a lot of times, you know. Dirts Bentley. Uh, I'm going to pick up all those names and put them back in my pocket now. <laughs> Dawn from Leamington? I've never heard of Leamington. What's a typical Randy Hauser day off like? Mm. Usually it's, uh, you know, most of the time we, if I'm off, Tatiana and I spend our time, you know, with West, my little boy, and Hawk, and we just go do stuff with them and and um, play catch up for the time that that I've been gone because it's uh we stay travel so much and when I get get home I want to see him, you know. Chase from Clarion said it's time for word association with Randy. Uh oh, what do you think when I say Corvette? I say Corvette, I think of my Uncle Woody because he used to have a bunch of Corvettes and that was the first Corvette I got to drive. When you say new boots, I think of uh, cow shit. <laughs> Can I say that? Because I think every pair of new boots needs to get some cow shit on them. <laughs> Y'all can beat that out if you want. Tour bus, I say, oh Lord, here we go again. On the road again. Just can't wait to get on the road again. Monica from Huntsville, how did you come up with the title Fired Up? It, The title Fired Up um, for the album was chosen because it just made the most sense. I mean, the song was written by Dallas Davidson and Rob Hatch, who are two of my best buddies. 
And, um, you know, whenever we, uh, whenever we started trying to figure out the name of the album, it just made total sense, you know, because I'm fi definitely fired up. <laughs> Rick from DeKalb, what artists do you like bumping into at country festivals? Um, all my friends. I mean, you know, I mean, you know, it's so fun. Like, Sunday night here will be at Country Thunder in Arizona, and, uh, and Eric Church will be there, and I'm not sure who all else, but, you know, I hope I get to bump into him and say hello. But there's all, always, you know, that's the thing about the festivals is it's, uh, it's a time that a lot of the artists that, that you don't get to see throughout the year that you're not touring with, you, you bump into them. So that's that's a lot of fun for us. It it turns into craziness backstage sometimes. Mary from Brooklyn says, favorite TV show when you're growing up? That's easy, the Duke boys. Dukes of Hazard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kelly from New Haven, given a chance to live anywhere, where would I live? Where would you live? I would live in the islands, probably. On the island junkie. Josh from Brownsville, if you could cover one classic rock song, which would it be? Mmm, that's tough. Um... Ah, that's a really tough one. Classic rock song. There's so many songs that I love. Um, I don't know. That's a tough one. I don't know. Probably something. I mean, any Skinnerd song would be would be fine. Sarah from Rochester. If you could call yourself by a rap name, what name would you make up for yourself? I don't have to make it up. I, I'm just gonna call myself Cadillac. Donna from Cincinnati. At what point did you know that Fired Up was coming together like you envisioned? Well, God, I'm still not sure. <laughs> um, you know, I I think, uh, you know, whenever the album was out and the response came in is whenever uh, the only way to know because you just can't. That's a tough one because you always, as me, me, I get totally in, insecure about records and albums and things like that, and wondering what people are going to think. And like, that's a scary thing to me, you know. And whenever you're putting out new music, and it's it's kind of like being going into a new classroom and you're a kid with a bunch of different kids, you know, and wondering if they're going to like you. That's the same feeling, if that makes sense. So you you don't know until people respond. Bernie from South Dakota. What do you usually carry around in your pockets? Anything that would surprise us? A pocket knife. Sophie from Sophie from Wheeling. When you plan out a tour, are there certain cities you make sure you always go to? There are, um, you know, there there are places I really love to go. But a lot of times I'm traveling with the artists that I'm on tour with right now. Um, but you know, some notables. I love uh, going to. Um, Chicago is really nice. We love Chicago. Uh, Los Angeles. One of my favorite places to play is um, uh, in Milwaukee at the Rave. And also, you know, you know th those are those are pretty definitely places we got to get to. Um, Christine from Dayton. Hey, Christine. How long does it take you to write your thank yous and CD liner notes and do your friends ask to be put in? Um, it doesn't take very long. We just, I mean, I just sort of, you just kind of pour it out and uh, say your thank yous. And, and trying to remember the names is tough of everybody. Not remember the names, but remember everyone that was involved because it becomes a lot of people. But, yeah, I think it's, uh, you know, as long as you're, people can tell if you're, if you're really thankful, it makes, and I am. I think it's a, a I think it's a, everybody's a part of it, you know, and. And I uh, just try to include everybody that I can think of. Uh, do I do any impersonations? Can, can I do one for you, Vanna from Lancaster? Oh, I don't know. I don't. I don't really have any impersonations. Um, I don't know. I can't think of anything right now. If I think of something, I'll let you. I'll send it in later. Um, I enjoyed it. Thank y'all so much. Um, thanks again for sending in your questions today. Um, my new CD is called Fired Up. Uh, I want to say thanks again to Bobby for having me on the show. I appreciate y'all's time. And uh, I'm about to go do something. <laughs>
by y'all.